lot of comments lately, and we haven't had enough time to respond to all of them. Sorry about that. So we made a short video to respond to just a couple of the outstanding comments from uh, you lovely viewers. So uh, the first one, uh, go ahead, take this one, Cash. All right, let's see. It's uh, someone named Aiden Wallace. It's not funny, it's sad. By the way, I just want to go ahead and note they did not use apostrophes okay. between the T and the S on its. Understandable. What if you were that chipmunk and he shot you? Everything caps, not funny now, A. Hey, Alright, my first question is, are you a Canadian viewer? And our second question would be, are you in the Navy? Because you're either Canadian or you're in the Navy. Um, second of all, it's not funny, it's sad. That sounds more like personal opinion. What if the chipmunk shot you? Highly unlikely. Um, we, there is a couple of counts of chipmunk shootings, but um, I they, think they, only in Canada. They're right? most mostly undocumented. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. So um, as far as if you if you did not enjoy the video or you felt a little uh, disturbed by it, we did put up a warning saying yeah. that your discretion is advised. Clearly, this viewer did not have discretion. Not not much discretion there, Mr. Wallace. So next question. Um, this is from Stulis number nine, Stulace. Make another one of these, dot, dot, dot. You might earn yourself another subscriber with more comedy videos. Emoji. Um, thank you, number nine. Um, uh, would you have anything to say? Well, uh, it's not exactly a comedy channel, but we do like to spice things up and keep it a little funny here and there. Yeah, we do We do like some comedy, but other than that, we're a pretty serious and straight. Pretty, pretty channel. Hunter type channel. We're extremely straight. Dante, Lord of Fire, Allahu Akbar, three exclamation points. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to respond to that. Other than he uh, blew up the comment section. <laughs> okay. Uh, um, Terra Dara Bros. Now, uh, check this out, guys. This is a pretty cool channel. If you haven't checked them out, go check them out. We just have them throw in one of their comments because it makes us feel special. Other than that, thank you for checking this out, guys. Chance Rasmussen. Yeah. What type of traps are those? Uh, the, the trapping kind. They are the trapping kind. Good insight. Um, also, if you want to get a little bit more specific, they're Duke Korean made. We like Korean made traps because they're cheap, but they're not that bad. You know. You know. Yeah. You save know. a little money for your wallet. Yeah, you do that. Sean John or Shane John. Um, Looks like he has earphones and a lollipop in. I don't know what that says about him. He like a very angry viewer. He does. Uh, that was four days ago, so we're going to check this out. You're, no apostrophe, mm -hmm. a finagling psychopath. Why the finagle would you shoot squirrels and chipmunks? You can't finagle and eat them. Now, what do you have to say about that, Cash Well, actually, you can eat them. And we, I personally eat squirrels and chipmunks quite often. I was a little bit shocked when I heard that because I was like, what? You can't eat them? Like, I just didn't know what to do with myself. Yeah, I, was was like, I was like, oh my gosh. I'm like, do I, do I need to go to a hospital or something? Yeah, so uh, we went back and we checked a couple of uh, the um, Urban Hunters videos and uh, where we were eating squirrel and chipmunk and things that such, and uh, those guys seemed okay. But, um, I mean, we don't have, like, documentation that you can actually eat squirrels because, I mean, who knows? I mean, this guy seems educated. As for the next line, it says, and you just wound them and cause them pain. Well, actually, after they're wounded, we killed them. Um, pain does cease after death. Now, again, yes. we don't have any documentation of that, but um, Sean John is educated, apparently. So. And uh, he is not a finagling naturalist or anything. This is just finagled up your piece of finagle. Mm -hmm. Well, no. if he's not a naturalist, then he must be an environmentalist. So that says something about him right there. So uh, we're going to discard that mm -hmm. comment, Mr. John. Thank you for watching. Yeah, we don't like environmentalist foreign liberals. <laughs> Obama in chains. Project Prodigy. Hmm. Stop making videos that kill land animals. All right, okay. first, Mr. Project Prodigy. Free country, man. Second of all, we are currently working on raising money for a expedition to Antarctica. Antarctica. Where we intend to spear a blue whale. Now, if we can't spear him, we will be bringing golf clubs, which we could badger the blue whale, possibly. Possibly. Um, now, or that would be a non-land animal, which would go nicely with Project Prodigy's might, statement. Yeah, and that might attract Project Prodigy's friends. Yes, and that would, be, more subscribers. that would be more subscribers. And uh, we're always trying to, you know, do right by the viewer. That's our motto, isn't it? <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. 
So um, uh, we will be um, looking into that in the future. Thank you, Project Project. Um, now, here's a very interesting comment we got from a uh, Marcelo, Marcelo, Marcelo JC mm -hmm. two days ago. Um, we have had a lot of these questions in the comment board, but it goes something along the lines of no capital domestic cat question mark. Um, that's a good question. Thank you for asking. We really appreciate it. We usually don't get complicated questions like this, but this one seems to be very insightful and mind-provoking thought, action activated. So uh, we're going to try to respond to that as best we can. Would you like to take this one? All right, let's see. Domestic cat question mark. Um, I, think the, I think the answer is no. No. Um, chipmunks do look like cats. We've gotten that confused before. Not that we've shot a cat or anything. Am I right? <laughs> okay. Deer and cats are confused. If you're from Canada, like uh, like our friend, um, <laughs> I don't know what his what name. Whatever. Wallace. Wallace. Arden Wallace. Yes. The very Canadian. I. Okay. Hey. Oh. All right. Uh, let's see. Take this one. Natisha Borden. You are horrible. Why would you do such a thing to a small, harmless little animal? Would you like it if you were a squirrel and I set traps out to kill you? No, you wouldn't, so I advise you stop making these types of rough yes. videos. Maybe try making videos about hunting things and big animals, nothing like squirrels. Now, I do have a statement. If I was a squirrel, um, I wouldn't, I don't think I'd live more trapped. I'd be more of a Yes, yes, and I'm kind of questioning how well this viewer is, you know, and in terms of setting traps. Is she a very good trapper? I don't know, but if she was a very good trapper, I probably wouldn't like it at all, because I mean, she might know the ins and outs of trapping squirrels, which is a profitable business, let me yeah, tell you. It's yes. about 50 cents a pelt. So. Yes, and uh, if there's one thing we could say is, you know, squirrels are uh, not on short supply. They are, they there's, couple. there's quite a lot of them I've out seen there. them in the wild, so. Yes, so, um, I mean, as far as, I mean, it's, I guess she was a little offended by the video and other Maybe kids, she has a pet squirrel? Maybe she has a pet squirrel, mm -hmm. but uh, maybe, maybe she just shouldn't watch the video. Or maybe maybe a different type it's of video. Probably, it probably isn't the, yeah, it's probably isn't the channel for uh, not, not teaching. teaching one. Thank you, Miss Morton, for your comment. But um, we're going to look into getting bigger animals. Actually, we have an upcoming bear hunt. Oh, yes. Where we're looking to get a bear hunt, a bear, and North Georgia Mountains. This so. past Friday, me and uh, Koala Grills here went uh, up to the North Georgia Mountains around uh, Justice Mountain. It was Justice Mountain. And, yep, yep. And uh, we uh, came across a rather large black bear, around 600, 700 pounds. Rather large indeed. We and didn't uh, take them. Um, we had a pocket knife, and we tried. Uh, well, technically it wasn't in season yet, but the bear hunting season, as long as we, along with the deer hunting season, as in for firearms opens up this weekend, and we do intend to bag a little bit of both this season, so we'll be, we'll be stay tuned. Oh, Red Survival. Um, thank you for this comment, Red Survival. Um, and it is, you guys suck. It's very thoughtful. Thank that you. That was thoughtful. Um, thank you. Well, we're going to try to do some less sucking. We make a lot of blowgun videos, so maybe it's a little more blowing. Maybe it's more blowing and less sucking, because... But um, I, I mean, I guess I guess maybe you got confused with a blowgun and a suck gun. Yeah, that is, that is a possibility. Uh, blowgun and suck guns don't work the same way because if you suck and do a blowgun, it doesn't end well. Anyway, let's, let's go to this next. All right. This one. Storm Raider Twenty Two Dot R B L X. I wish I had a blowgun. Now this, I guess this goes along with uh, Red Survival's. You guys suck. Well, what about a what about a gun gun? How about that? A gun gun would work. Um, a, a bow gun. As far as uh, wanting a blowgun... If you don't own a blowgun, of course, which you can get one, I mean, if you want. We have a couple of videos on how to make that. Mm -hmm. But, um, I wish I had a blowgun. Thank you. That's deep, Storm Raider. We're going to put some thought into that, and, uh, yeah. maybe, uh, Seriously, work on that. Maybe work on that, uh, in that comment. Thank you for that. That was inspirational. Um, well, um, that's all the comments we have time for today. We really appreciate you guys watching. Cash Money and Crawford on the camera. PD Frizz. PD Frizz, yeah. Not Crawford. Benjamin Crawford. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> the student ID of Cash Money is... <laughs> 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 Edit time. Yeah, pause it. How do you pause it?